Hi, my name is Dr. Robin Abramsic, and I'm a biological dentist in Heath, Texas. The name of my practice is Smile Ranch Dentistry, and today I would like to share with you on how to stretch after a phrenectomy is performed. And we see babies here every week, and we perform the phrenectomy with a laser. And we start underneath the tongue. The cervical site underneath the tongue will often look like a diamond. And around day four or five, it looks yellowish or a whitish color. So I encourage the moms and the fathers to think about what is the function of the tongue, and that is to elevate the tongue and to press the nipple to the palate. And so whenever the tongue is lifted for the stretch, that really helps because functionally you want the tongue to elevate. And you'll go to the diamond. There will be a fold. Right at the fold is where you want to target the pressure, not force. Elevate the tongue with one finger and then roll and stroke the fiber, stimulating the blood flow. And you can actually sing a song like roll, roll, roll your boat. Make it fun with a baby. Then you'll want to stretch underneath the lip. So you'll lift the, fill, the lip high until you feel a bump and wiggle and stimulate the blood flow underneath the lip. I recommend that after the procedure, you start at dinner time. And then the following day, you want to stretch baby at least four times a day, even up to six times a day. And the week following, you want to, you can drop down to three times a day, then the week following twice a day, then one time a day. I always see my babies one week out and my approach is integrative. So the moms and the dads work closely with their lactation consultants and also with their body workers. So that is our integrative approach. I would like to demonstrate with you with Hudson. And a couple of other things that you can do with the stretches is moving the tongue side to side. So the baby will be a little sore. They might not want to move, but you want to encourage movement and you want to encourage skin on skin and even taking warm baths to help calm baby down. And what you can do is as you're doing the stretches, you can also lateralize the tongue. So stimulating the lower gum line and you'll see the tongue move over toward the right, stimulating the lower left, the tongue will move over to the lower left. You can actually massage gently the palate and you can turn your finger over and massage the tongue. You can even play tug of war with the baby. So those are some extra things that you can do to encourage movement. Okay, so this is Hudson. He is a month old. He had his phrenectomy one week ago. Mom has been working with her lactation consultant and with a body worker. So we're gonna start in roll, roll, roll your boat. And you'll get underneath the tongue, lifting it high and roll, roll, roll. And then underneath the lip, you can wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. And then you can also add the other, other stretches that we talked about. Thank you so much.